Hi everybody. This is Fred. This is what I'm going to do today. Right here, this area here, I'm going to cut out some, some finger grooves in this area right here. Got the birds all singing. Be real careful. Looking how it is. I'm going to cut out some little finger grooves right here for the, on this Mossberg 410. Yeah, I got some varnish here and then I'll do that later. <laughs> yeah, I've got some stain. Yeah, and just some varnish and some stain. Got this here. Got some sandpapers and see if I can do this without messing it up. Draw the pattern. That's the first one here. See here, like where it goes. The first finger goes there, then the next one you go right about there, then your little finger. You can kind of see how it's going to fit. Now I got it adjusted to where, like, I'm holding it. I'm ready to hold it. Like, I'm ready to hunt with it, and that's the way kind of want it kind of had to figure out just how you're holding it and right where you want to slow have to do it slow to make it blend in get you a little close-up view and just not too deep just a little finger hold and then yeah the little pattern for up around this finger here it's going to stick up higher so it will have to come up higher
okay. Kind of see where the next one goes. The finger, see, from there to there. Now you got your little finger down here. Just take a little one. And just sit up there like that's how you're holding it. Like how you hold it when you're out there carrying it or you're hunting. Just gives you another little grip. Little custom grip. That's all I'm doing. Not going too far. Trying not to mess up. If I mess up, well, gotta order another one, boys. So that's just what I'm doing. Just adding that to it. Just a little grip. One more here. Let's see where that in there goes. It's okay. The little finger. And see where that kind of goes. Just kind of customizing my own little, little 410, as you can see. There we go. Last one, boys. Double check. I'm holding it, boys. I got me a squirrel out there. Targeted. You see just about where it's got to go. Right about there. Get a little speed on it.
What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Huh? Yeah, that's where we all can see. I'm gonna round off some of the edges, make it look rounded. I think I'm gonna stop right there. Just get the little grip right where your fingers go. Just right there, boys. I'm gonna turn it around here where y'all can see at different angles. Look at it at different angles. Yep. That's just about as far as I'm going to go with it. I thought I'd custom it, customize it just a little bit for the grip. Yep. I'll probably stand down on the stock. i got a pattern on there, as you can see. A little pattern. I'm going to stand this whole thing and use that as black you know the outline come up with some kind of a pattern there's a pattern on the other side where you can see where i just kind of but that's what i'm doing right there trying to see if i can get the good angle you know yeah for just a little grip 410 grip out there Just a grip, putting a little grip onto it. Nothing fancy, I don't guess. Huh? I'm not going to do nothing on the other side. Just that one right there. Just that right there. I think as far as I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with that, it's got enough grip. More than like just keep on going till I get too too deep. It's like it's a, a good comfortable grip right there. Good comfortable grip. So this is Fred out here doing that today. Just putting a little pattern up on up on the 14 Mossberg. Sun going down, just going to add a little grip to it, boys. So, thanks for watching. I believe that's all I'm going to do. I believe that's good enough. That's about the way I want it. Yep. So, if you got a hobby and you know that you want to do something with a hobby well give it a try well you can't do nothing but like mess it up and order another part if you mess up that's what i'm talking about yep just a little grip just a grip onto a 410 boys just a little bit then I'll take some of this stain and stuff when i'm all done i'll figure out me a pattern I got another color of stain 
This is a brand new can right here. That thing is at about $17 for what, a quart? <laughs> no, you got 32 ounces. Yeah, well, one U.S. quart of that oil base. And we'll work with this a little while. So thanks for watching. And if you got a hobby and you're not scared to try it, uh, try it your way, I guess. And yeah, that's all I can say to it. Just find you a hobby. Yep, I've been wanting a good grip on here. I missed my other one up, but I don't think I missed this one up. It's got the smooth grip. So thanks for watching. And y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.